<laughs> We're doing more chip reviews, the food reviews. We got a threesome today, y'all. I got three chips. We're doing three chips, three sacks of chips. Uh, I got these while we were traveling. Um, what the heck is that called? Ballrick. Ballricks. Oh yeah, there it is. Ballrike. Ballrike. Ballrikes. B a l l r e i c h. Ballrikes. Tiffin, Ohio. So we have three flavors, man. We're gonna uh some new stuff. So I guess these are Ohio. We got honey butter, as you can see here. At the bottom it says Marcelled flavor. I don't know what that means. Marcelled flavored? What does that mean? Somebody tell me what that means. I don't know what that means. Honey butter flavored chips, Marcelled flavor. All right, that's number one. We're gonna do all three of these right now. No reason to do three separate videos. They're all the same company. This one says Marcel flavor too. Ball Reich. Sweet Tide Chili. Excited for those two. And the third one, we gotta do last because it's gonna ruin my taste buds probably. Ball Reich. Ghost Pepper Jack. Yikes. So let's jump on into that. Here's, uh, here's this cute bag, by the way. Belly buddy. Eat my belly buddy. Let's jump on into it, man. Honey butter ball, right? Honey butter is a strange flavor for a potato chip, but you never know. I've definitely had stranger. Doesn't smell crazy. Ball or uh, ghost pepper jack is the only one that doesn't say Marcel flavor. And also at the bottom it says better than ever from Tiffin, Ohio. Hmm. You're bad. It's a subtle sweetness. Again, there's your honey butter. Sorry about the sun and the glare. Y'all don't want to see me anyway. It's not bad. They're definitely different. The sweet is there, but it's not overpowering. They're all right, man. I'm going to uh, try to score it right now. No, we'll wait. You got to wait for the score. Cleanse my palate. Boom. All right. Sweet Thai chili. This one has a whole lot more ingredients. That one, ooh, you smell these boys, man. Okay. Okay. Okay, ball right. Sweet Thai chili. Yep, ASMR or whatever, it's happening right now. Man, I'm totally getting that taste like a salad, uh, like that wing, like a wing flavor. Mm. 
That's pretty damn good, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, boy. Packed full of flavor dust. Sweet tart chili seasoning. Pepper, spices. No craving. That's pretty good. It's not really hot. I expected to have a lot of heat to it. Not really. Maybe a little, but nothing crazy. That's pretty darn good. I enjoy that. I'm going to keep that right next to me because I'm going to need it. Oh, see, this one has a story. What's going on with this one, man? So the Ghost Pepper Jack, we got the Better Than Ever from Tiffin, Ohio. And then on the back, we got the story. Locally owned for over 100 years. Ball Reich. Let's read the story before my mouth cuts on fire. It was 1920 when Fred Ball Reich started making potato chips that have since become an area favorite. Business began in a floorless garage with a copper kettle full of shortening and heated with wood scraps. Fred and his brother Carl worked all day to produce about 14 pounds of potato chips. Although the company has been modernized, it remains in the same location. Today, Ballrick Snack Food Company is still locally owned and operated. Our quality and freshness have kept our customers coming back. We ship around the world so customers that have moved out of the area can phone, fax, or email to take advantage of our mail order service. There you guys go. People always ask. Thank you for making Ball Rikes your favorite chip. We welcome your comments. As always, satisfaction is guaranteed. So there you guys go, man. Everybody always wants to ask where they can try things. So you, get, you know, I may not grab some snacks on the road. They may not be able to get them. I'm not looking forward to this. I hope this is good. Fingers crossed it's good, guys. Don't be too hot. Ghost Pepper Jack. It's eating up. What a weird light. The sun is going down. Hmm. It's getting hot. It's getting hot. The cheesy flavor isn't bad, but the heat that's coming with it, it's just not for me. It's not a, like people like hot, that's not my thing. I like hot wings, I like like a buffalo hot. But this is just hot, hot. But I gotta eat a few. But the actual flavor is pretty good. Just that heat. So far, though, I dig it. I'm starting to get a little sweaty. It's not too crazy, though. Not too crazy. I was real worried with the ghost pepper. It's definitely hot, but it's not a. It's not scaring me away. Sometimes a nice hot chip is pretty good, you know? It's <clears throat> getting hot in my throat, though. Man. It's hot, but it's not crazy. It's not overwhelming just yet. But, flavor-wise, man, much better than expected. I'm not going to lie. They're pretty good. If you like hot and you like flavor, definitely give these a shot, man. You can order them online or you can get them in Tiffin, Ohio. Or you can go to ballrike.com, B-A-L-L-R-E-I-C-H, and have them ordered. 
All right, one more. Let it soak in. These are good, man. These are flavorful. Definitely above average chip. Uh, a little spicy, but good. I'm going to give these a... Hmm. I'm going to give these a 6.8. Ballerike Ghost Pepper Jack, 6.8. going to go backwards here. Sweet Thai Chili. These got some real good flavor. I'm gonna go ahead and give these a 7.1. Yeah, 7.1 on these sweet hot chilies. Definitely pick these up, man. These are good. These are good, flavorful chips. Not too far off. I mean, they, they taste way different, but I'm saying on the scale. And then we got the honey butter, which is the ones I thought I would like the most. And they're good. But compared to the other two, man, I don't think they fit the bill. They're pretty plain. Um, slightly better than plain. They're actually getting the hot out of my mouth right now. But, uh, I'm going, I'm going 6.6. .6 on the honey butter they're nice slightly above average slightly better than plain they got that little bit of sweet in them I mean, they're not bad if you if you know what i'm saying like if plain is too plain but the flavor stuff is too flavorful this is like a little bit better than plain a little honey butter gets a little sweet in there not too bad all in all though man these are pretty good. I might have hit up the website myself, see what other flavors they have, if they have any other, uh, you know, off-the-wall flavors. I generally don't just do, like, original or whatever just because it's another company. I just like the, the, the different flavors you find. But, uh, yeah, definitely check it out, man. So there it is. That's the review. Three chips. Let me know what your guys' favorite chips. Let me know if you've had these. If you're from Tiffin, Ohio, and you know all about the, the ball rocks, let me know. Uh, and if you're ball right and you want to send me some chips, man, I got you. I'll eat them. So there you go. Honey butter, sweet Thai chili, and ghost pepper jack. That's a review.